Hey guys, my name is Astro and I am back for another tutorial. I'm just going to take some out because I didn't change my settings and I just pressed uh, record, so I didn't press stream. I want to see if it still is a stream. Thank you guys so much for subscribing, though, even if this um, isn't a stream. You're so far in this, like, I don't even know. Uh, uh, Alright, good. We're not streaming. Good, 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 good. Alright, listen. So. I had people tell me they wanted to know how to freaking OBS, like OBS tutorial, right? So, pretty easy. I'm gonna show you guys how to work OBS. I just have my Roblox set as that because Roblox is my monitor capture. So, the first thing you're gonna wanna do is create your scene, name it whatever you want, and then go over your sources, add one by pressing global sources or just right clicking anywhere, um, pressing a scroll over add and press it or whatever. And then start off by making a monitor capture. Now, if you're just trying to make a gameplay of one game and not switching games, then do game capture. If you're doing Roblox and you gotta switch games more frequently, I recommend doing monitor capture. Now, this only works for some people, um, but there is a way to get alerts for your, uh, like a YouTube alert on screen, which I'll show you how to do that in this video. But guys, I wanna show you guys how to do all this, okay? But first, you're gonna get your monitor capture, uh, set it, you know, whatever you want. Oh wait, no, I'll actually show you. Monitor capture, name whatever you want. And then window, make it whatever window you have open. All right, guys, I only have a couple windows open, so make it what window you want open. All right, I'm gonna cancel that. Now I'm also gonna show you guys how to do live sub counts. So what you're gonna want to do for live sub count is make sure you go to your uh, to Google. Once you go to Google look up live subscriber count. You don't even have to go to Google, as a matter of fact. Uh, just look up live subscriber count. It's going to take you to that page. Once you go there, you're just pressing anyone. It really doesn't matter. And all you got to do is type in your name. And then it's going to pop up as you. And all you got to do is go down to OBS, take add, go to CLR browser, aim it whatever you want, and then copy the one that you have opened, go back to OBS, and put it in and then once you put it in it's gonna make it go to of course the actual live subscriber count but the live subscriber count is too big so we're just gonna press edit C and make it how small we want it's not gonna do it by that so we're gonna make it a little bit bigger actually and then hold alt okay guys just make sure you hold alt when you do this because this is the key right now this is the best thing you need so press alt and that's just gonna crop it once you crop it make it the size of um, how you want it like right there and then you can put it anywhere you want guys right here, wherever you want you can put it in the middle of the screen if you wanted to middle of the screen all right so we got that down we're just gonna remove that okay now i have people that tell me how to do a logo well if you have a logo already um make sure you go down to add and go to, go to image all you got to do is name it whatever you want browse your images and click on it um like we have right there and once you click on it it's gonna pop in and all you got to do is hold alt to crop it again now so we are going to delete that. Wait, no, we're not because we're just gonna uncheck it for now. Actually, no, we'll leave it. But I also have my friend's logo because he streams with me, and I also have his sub or I also have his uh, subscriber count because I mean, like, why not? So uh, let's go back to our uh, thing. Okay. Now the BRB thing. I have uh, all you gotta do is go to Google, save a picture to your uh, pictures file. I'm sure you guys already know how to do that. Just right click it and press save picture as and name whatever you guys want. Oh, or you guys can just make whatever one you want in Photoshop. I don't think it's really needed to make a beer right back picture. So, anyway, all you gotta do is do that, and then you do this. Add image. It's the same thing for the logo, but you just pick that picture, name it whatever you want, and then just make sure you crop it as you know as much as you can. But that's as much as I can crop it. So, maybe I can. Uh... Yes, yeah, I can't uh, make it bigger, but it's okay. <laughs> yeah, but we're not gonna do that. We're just gonna do that. All right, guys, that is as much as I can do for that. But go back to uncheck that. Now, I had people say, how do you do the uh, subscriber alert? So make sure you go to your Gmail or Yahoo or wherever you guys got. But I'm pretty doggone sure you have a Gmail. I'm pretty sure you need a Gmail for YouTube, but I'm not really sure. So, guys, go to your Gmail. And all you got to do is go to settings. Go to settings again. Uh, pretty straightforward there. Then go down to uh, go down to 
labels, my bad, go to labels, labels, and then go all the way down, create new label, and then all you gotta do is enter the name, and then it's done, all right? Once you enter the filter, all you guys gotta go do then is go to the, uh, once you uh, created the label, you go to filters, but we're, we're actually gonna create one right now. We're gonna create one. Test. All right, now all you guys gotta do is go to filters, and create a new filter, but from no reply at youtube.com to nobody subject has subscribed oh wait has subscribed um, to or you can put whatever you want there but we're just going to say has subscribed to and that's all I got to do for that and then just press create filter so we're just going to create the filter because why not um, and then I'm just going to go back to mine and we're gonna exit out of this. Now go back to your uh, test file or subs file. Holy crap, we have a lot of subs, okay? And now look at this, it's gonna say, Silver Scout to subscribe to you on YouTube, okay? Now all you're gonna wanna do now is open up your OBS, go to create a new scene, add, and then do window capture. Make sure you name whatever you want, and then just put it at you what you want. So we, we're at subs right now. Uh, so yeah, do that, and we're just gonna make this a lot smaller because we don't want it that big. That is really big. Oh crap, we messed up, guys. So we gotta remove that. Yep. All right, so make a new one, guys. Make sure you go to window capture. Okay. That, and then make sure you press sub region, but make sure you have that as half the screen, and then click out of there and make OBS the other half of the screen because we need that. All right. Uh, all right. Nice, nice, nice. So over here and press sub region and then region select region now let's get a select region of what you guys want to put as the region but we need to move that out of the way actually so let's move that crap out of the way real quick uh matter of fact we can just do it like that guys so pretty good all right boys we can just do it like that boom, 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 boom. all right now what we're gonna we kind of want to do is select region and make sure it's put on this thing or whatever. What the heck? Um, select region. There we go, baby. Here we go, baby. So what you're gonna want to do is make it small. Come on. I just gotta bring this up. Make it small. All right. So we're gonna make it. Oh wow. Great. So we just lost it. Select region. There we go. We, oh wait. We gotta make it at least a little bit big so it covers up something. Uh, like this right here, Nico Gamer has subscribed. We're just gonna go like that, guys, and then scroll this over. And then we're gonna want to bring this all the way down to about there, and then just press Escape or click outside this rectangle when you're done. Uh, but make sure it says, you know, subscribed. Don't put the two in it. Wait. Subscribe. Yep. We're actually just gonna do that. Yeah, guys, we're just gonna do that because it seems like Nico's right there. All right, boom. You might have to do this every time you restart a stream, but let's go plus okay. And it doesn't work for me, but it's fine. It doesn't have to work for me, I don't care. As long as it works for you guys, if it doesn't work for you, uh, go watch a professional do it. I'm not a professional, I'm just, you know, I'm still learning, but make sure you go watch a professional on that. And then all I gotta do is delete that if it doesn't work. But it doesn't work for me, obviously. So, now I had uh, people tell me, well, what if I wanna add text? Well, you can add text all you want, guys. So, but we got a sub goal text, subscribe goal 1000. All you gotta be doing for that is press add and then text, name whatever you want, uh, YouTube. And then just put whatever you find. It doesn't show you what type of font it is, it's really weird. Color, you can change whatever color you want. We can put like a fluorescent blue. Uh, text, I don't know what that is. Uh, background color, we can put like an orange background color, okay. We can even use an outline. And for the outline, we're just gonna do a black outline, see what that kind of looks like. And then text, we're gonna put, uh, so, wait, what was it earlier? Subscriber goal 1000. Subscriber goal 1000. Once you have that, press OK. You can put whatever you want in it, like I said. But make sure you uh, check it. Okay, so wait, why is there no background? I messed up on the spelling, by the way. 
Oh yeah, I forgot you can put bold and stuff. It's in the settings right there. Right now. All you gotta do is go to properties, and you can change whatever you spell wrong. So just do that. And of course, you want the bolds. We can do we can do vertical. No, we're not. We're gonna do underline, italic, and bold all together. Okay. Look at that, guys. That looks super duper cool. And then subscriber goal 1,000. It even says it right there. We can we might even change it, but I don't know. That's all you gotta, guys gotta do. It is super simple. It's really it is. Uh, but yeah, that's all you gotta do. Now we're gonna go back to mine. We're actually gonna change it. And just so you guys know that you can change the uh, the text and stuff. Subscriber goal 1,000. We're gonna put the double dot there. Uh, we're gonna put bold, italic, and an underline just to see what it looks like. Uh, why not the vertical? Why not the vertical? But oh crap. Not the vertical, not the vertical. Take out the vertical. Um, I did just post a video of me doing a face reveal, guys. So if you guys do want to check that out, make sure you go check it out in, um, in my video sections. Alright, so get that out of there. Because I know a lot of you guys wanted to see my face. There we go, guys. Perfect subscriber goal. 1,808 subscribers. It is super awesome, guys. It is really well working. Uh, it doesn't work for me, this thing. But it does work for everybody else, apparently, so... You know, make sure you go check out. And look at this, you can still close it and it still stays there. Uh, I mean, you can click through it and... Also, I want to add another scene. I mean, look, look what just happened if you want to add another scene. You can put, uh, Sims 4, right? I don't play Sims 4, but... Just out of curiosity, curiosity, you put Window Capture Sims. And then just, uh, you know, put whatever. Like yourself the edge, there you go. Oh, wait, no, 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 delete that. Let's say you wanted a monitor capture. And put it like that. There you go, guys. We got that. But you want to get back to your old settings. There you go. So if you ever want to switch games and you want to do it super fast and you switch games, all you got to do is go from Roblox to your other game right there. Now, this works. Do this does work very This does. Uh, this does work very well. So make sure you guys go check it out. Um, now, you can still add the logo and stuff if you still want to. But super easy. Still, look, we can even add. Uh, banners. We can even have banners, guys. We can even have banners. Well, we still got that black stuff. But do we care about that black stuff? No, we do not. So we're just going to go ahead and press Alt and just take all that black stuff out because we don't like it and we want it back to a regular banner. Like, just like that, guys. Just like that. Perfect. Now, all you got to I mean, you can put it wherever you want. Like, whatever. Let, let, let's just say we just want to put it down here. All right? Perfect. There it is, guys. But we're gonna delete the Sims 4 scene. Now this is very good for switching games, like I just said. But uh, yeah. So, uh, crap. I want to uh add something here. We're actually gonna have my banner. We're gonna have my banner image uh, banner. And then we're just gonna go to uh, image and press whatever one we want. This one is my favorite so far, so we're just gonna press OK on that. And we're gonna make it big, but then we're just gonna alt it down to the right size that we want. So. We're just gonna go hold Alt and do this. Now you gotta be careful when you're doing Alt because you don't want to mess up and slip and then lose all that stuff. That would suck. But look at that, guys. It is super simple. Uh, it really is, guys. So make sure you do check it out. Um, I don't know what the heck. <laughs> uh, actually, I'm gonna put this at the bottom of the screen, guys. Nah, that's too much on the screen. All right, guys. If you did like the video and it did help you out a lot, make sure to like and subscribe. I will probably do another one on Expo, but it's, I mean, no, probably not. It's, you know, not even good. But yeah, guys, make sure you like and subscribe the video, please. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, that's going to be this, this is going to be our fourth video uploaded today. So don't forget to go like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, guys.